That was way colder than I thought it would be. <sighs> yeah. All right, <laughs> what's going on, y'all? It's late today. It's like almost 7 p.m. I'm out here. I still gotta change my shoes, get them dusty old kicks, and put on my skate shoes. My hip has been like acting up the past couple days. I was falling asleep yesterday, and like my hip, I like literally popped it back into place. So that's a little bit weird, if I do say so myself anyway. As I'm getting my shoes on here, I'll tell you guys the plan for today, which is literally just to come out here and fix my feeble grinds because they have been hella inconsistent, and I would like to get them back because they were a trick I wanted for such a long time, and honestly, one of the only tricks besides board slides I could do on this rail so that being said I'll catch you all on the court all right so since we don't have that much time today and it's gonna be sundown in like less than an hour I'm just gonna get straight onto the rail I'm probably not gonna do too much flat ground today I'm just gonna warm up with a couple board slides and get straight to the feeble grind but I will say something it is mad weird being here this is where I filmed basically most of my first videos for this channel was on this basketball court back when I had like basically no subscribers and now I'm at like 300 which also I know I didn't put up a video saying you know thank you guys for the 300 subscribers but honestly from the bottom of my heart thank you guys so much it really means the world to to me that anybody would watch these videos is pretty dope and I hope I've been an inspiration can inspire and will continue to inspire you guys to get out on your board as often as you can and really push yourselves and see what you're made of and what you can do on your board and off your board and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day anyway let's not get too sentimental I'll do that in a future video next milestone we hit of course but yeah let's get on the rail and uh, see what we can do all right I'll talk to you all then This is bad, you guys. I think I lost them. I got like one or two into board slides and they came out. Sorry if this is super wobbly, I'm holding the camera and it's so heavy right now, but I haven't gotten any just out to regular and they're super inconsistent. I know I'm dealing with the rail on the middle setting, but it's tough. So I'm gonna keep going. I probably have about half an hour left. So I'm gonna give it a shot, see what happens. My hip is really hurting though. Whew. All right, let's give it a shot. Yeah, you guys, I think it might be official. Not necessarily that I lost them because I did land one or two, but again, slipping into a board slide. But they're very short to the point where it's kind of impossible to hold the grind without the front truck wanting to slip out into a board slide. So I don't know. I'm gonna mess around with them a little bit more. This video is gonna be super boring probably, but this is the process. This is how I learn tricks. And, and this is kind of how I relearn tricks if I start to lose them or lose consistency with them. But yeah, so let's get back to these. Do a couple more until I honestly can't do any more or till daylight runs out. It's almost 8 p.m. This kind of blows, I'm not gonna 
lie, but to be honest, I kind of expected it though, because I've been focusing so much on crooked grinds and I haven't brought the rail out here. We're not going to lose hope. We're not going to lose sight of the goal. The goal is to get these feeble grinds on lock consistently, and that's what we're going to do. So even if it takes like three or four sessions, this is what I'm going to get out here and do. So I'll catch you guys in a minute. Let's get back to the grind. No pun intended. Let's go. All right, so I hate to admit it, but I'm gonna go out and say it. I don't think I ever learned feeble grinds properly. So I think in the videos you guys seen me do in the past, what I had ended up doing in all those videos where you guys saw me learn the feeble grinds, what would happen is I would kind of overshoot the heel side lock and my front end of my board would be dipping over the rail a little too much. And so when I got towards the end, it would slip out into a board slide, right? The board wasn't locked into the side of the rail like it's supposed to be for a feeble grind. And how do I know this? Well, in this session, I got like one or two, maybe a handful of decent feeble grind lock-ins that actually locked in properly. Now I'm talking like the board was on the rail and so was the heel side wheel of my truck, of my back truck, right? The reason why I say I don't think I actually ever learned them was because it feels entirely different, right? It really does feel different. I'm kind of like figuring things out slowly again. I remember I was having an issue a while ago, which is I would come out and have that heel side rotation once I was getting out, but that was actually a good thing. That actually meant that I was getting into the proper lock-in, right? The way I kind of fix that was by actually doing them the wrong way, which would be overshooting my front truck too much to the point where it was kind of dipped over and not locked in the rail, which would force me in that board slide. And then I would just kind of turn my shoulders and twist out. But that's not a proper feeble grind, right? So it's an unfortunate realization, but it's one that I have come to terms with, I've accepted, and I hope you guys can accept that as well. Of course, I'm sure you guys don't really care, but I know you guys don't want to see me do feeble grinds for the next five years. So it is something I'm going to come out here and get until I have them proper. It's going to take some time of course, but you know, you guys have seen me progress a ton in the past couple months or so, especially learning crooked grinds properly in about a couple of weeks. I think I get these down as long as I have a proper place to train and uh, maybe I'll just have to take my rail with me wherever I go or I'll figure something out. There's a ton of bugs around me right now. So that's gonna be it for this video. I'm sorry, I know it's a boring one. Didn't really do much flat grad, didn't really do anything except for practice these feeble grinds, but this is my process. This is how I learn my tricks. And this is also why I started my channel. I started my channel so that I could just document how I learn tricks. I mean, that's really it. Sorry if this one bores you guys, but you know, I really want to be able to look back and tell myself you did what you needed to do to learn the trick the right way and properly. You might fail a hundred times, but what matters most is that you accept that, you move forward, and you eventually get back up and succeed, which is what I'm doing here with the feeble grind. So that's going to be it for this video. Sorry I went on a long tangent, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and y'all know what it is already. Keep safe, stay shredding. I love y'all and peace out.